Welcome back to Drinks Made Easy, because cocktails don't have to be difficult. Today we're taking a look at a recommended cocktail by a friend of the show, Lisa Grezzo, who had this at a great Italian restaurant here in Los Angeles, Rosso Blue. Now the bartender there was kind enough to share the recipe, and we have the Campanula, which is a name for the family of flowers known as the bell flower. Now this has bell peppers in it, and the Latin for Campanula is also little bell, so it's a pretty witty way of naming this drink. Best of all, because it has all that gardening aspect to it, if you get a little tipsy on this and someone gives you a hard time, just tell them, I'm not drinking, I'm just gardening. Or at least that's what I plan to do. To build the Campanula Sour, we're going to start with 10 uh, pieces of mint. Give it a quick little expression, and if you like more mint, you can always add more or scale back as your tastes prefer. Next, we're gonna add two ounces of white grapefruit infused vodka, one and a half ounces of Saint Germain, one ounce of lemon juice, and three quarters of an ounce of fresh bell pepper juice. Now, if you don't have a juicer, you can also always use a blender. Just make sure to take out the seeds before you blend it, and then just put it through a fine strainer. Cap that off into a shaker tin full of ice, and give it a good shake. Straight into the martini glass or drinking vessel of your choice. I mean, after all, in a pinch, anything that holds your drink will do. And then garnish with a nice sprig of mint. And easy as that, you have the Campanula Sour. Mm. The Campanula is kind of a interesting complex cocktail. You've got a little hint of the white grapefruit in the vodka. The bell pepper comes forward and the sweetness of the Saint Germain rounds it all out. Now this cocktail does have a lot of Saint Germain and some of you might be saying an ounce and a half of Saint Germain. Yes, in something that has this many strong flavors, it really needs it. You can make it at home and try it with just an ounce of Saint Germain, but I guarantee you the flavors are not going to be balanced or what you will enjoy as much as an ounce and a half. So try them out, let us know what you think.